morning children. I'm Priya Madam, your English teacher. Today we're going to the first lesson from your English textbook. The name of the lesson is Clever Tanali Ramakrishna. Clever Tanali Ramakrishna. Krishna Devalaya is the king of Vijayanagar. And he had an advisor by the name of Chitra Varma, who was a painter. And Tanali Ramakrishna happens to be a very good poet as well as a jester in the court. The story begins like this, children. It happened so that Krishna Deva Raya had engaged Chitra Varma as his advisor. Chitra Varma had no uh, idea of being an advisor to the king, but Krishna Deva Raya was impressed with Chitra Varma's painting. As he was a very good artist, Krishna Deva Raya said, I want you to be my advisor. So Krishna Deva Raya appointed him as the advisor in his kingdom. Tanani Ramakrishna did not approve of it. As Tanani Ramakrishna knew that Chitra Varma did not have any experience as an advisor. However, as the king had appointed him to be his advisor, Tanali Ramakrishna just thought it over. One day it happened so that Krishna Devaraya was invited to a feast of a little boy, the son. And as he went to the feast, he tasted the food and the food was tasteless. So Tanali Ramakrishna, who happened to be very clever and used his mind in a very fast method. He instantly got the idea and he suggested to Krishna Devaraya about a professional cook. When Krishna Devaraya questioned Tanali Ramakrishna who would be the cook, he said a carpenter could cook food much better. Krishna Devaraya, of course, questioned Tanali Ramakrishna. How could a carpenter cook food when he is connected only to make doors, windows and furniture? Instantly, Tanali Ramakrishna answered and said, King Krishna Devaraya, don't you think if a painter could be the advisor for a king, don't you think a carpenter could cook food very well? With this question and answer that Tanali Ramakrishna had given to the Krishna Devaraya, Krishna Devaraya was very impressed. And he said, Really, you gave such a good answer. It does strike me that if a painter could be an advisor, really a carpenter could be a very good cook. So this is how the story goes, children. Who was who was a clever person? Who had a clever mind? Tanavi Ramakrishna was a very clever person. He had a clever mind. No one could tell him but he could invent and build up such a lot of thoughts and stories. This is how it went, children, the story. Children, I hope you have understood the introduction of the story. Children, let us go to the glossary connected to the story. What do you mean by glossary? Glossary are meanings of particular words. 
glossary are meanings of particular words. Your Majesty, respect while addressing a king or queen. Your Majesty, respect while addressing a king or queen. Unique, very rare, one of a kind. Unique, very rare, one of a kind. Snapped, made a sound with finger. Snapped, made a sound with finger. Assured, promised. Assured, promised. Realize, understand. Realize, understand. Understand or understood is the same meaning. Realize, understand or understood is the same meaning. Grateful, thankful. Grateful, thankful. Children, I hope you have understood the story of clever Tenali Ramakrishna. As he had the most magnificent brains, and besides having a wonderful mind of his own, he was a good poet and a jester in Krishna Devaraya's kingdom. We'll meet again for the next class, children. Have a nice